What's going on everybody? Uh, today David T popped off and uh, I made this video about two weeks ago. So it's been a long, long swing trade. I hope you guys didn't drop out of it because it can get kind of boring at sometimes, but you just got to hold it. And that's what, you know, swing trading is all about. Uh, just like to remind you to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell so you get notifications and you know about these swing trades and uh, like this video. Let's get into the chart and see what our game plan is going to be for David T going on. So here's a video that I made for David T. Uh, let's see, it's published on the 15th, so it's pretty much about two weeks. So just a reminder, target price is still 348, and uh, it's under two dollars right now. So and the shares float are still 14 million, so this still could have some pop to it. All right, so we're looking at the chart here, and uh, I just drew a uh, resistance here. This is at 203. But before it even gets to the $2 mark, it has the 200 period here, which you can see it bounced off today. Has to break through that. Once it breaks through that, so that's about 179. So once it breaks through that, then the next resistance is going to say, let's make it even $2. Swing trades take a while. It could take a month, could take two weeks of just being down or being up. The thing is, you just have to know when to sell, how much profit you want to take, and when to get out of the stock. I would probably say I'm going to wait to about 278 to get out of the stock for a nice swing trade and uh, just make your profits. Don't get too greedy. That's the main thing. So we got a 145 support right here. So it's definitely going to have a pullback. It might bounce off of that. So kudos to you guys that stayed in this trade. Uh, you can't really find the bottom of these stocks. So you're pretty much are going to be in the red. But I mean, we got pretty close to the bottom and uh, now it's starting to pop up. Now we have to think about when we're going to sell and how much profit we want to take out of it. So like I said, I'm probably going to sell when it gets about 270 right around there for a nice little swing trade. But you guys can do whatever you feel is good for you. And i uh, just like to remind you to subscribe to my channel and like the video. And uh, let's make some money.